Hi fellow reefers. Today I thought I'd touch the topic on uh, the accessories that I use to feed the corals and what do I actually feed the corals. Well first of all I want to introduce you to this item. It's like a turkey baser but it's strictly to feed the liquid foods on the uh, tanks. This one has uh, an accessory where you pull this out and as you notice you can put like a piece of shrimp and then feed it like let's say to your anemones or or other uh, organisms. Not only that, it has an extension. Now, this of course uh, is not for this tank, uh, but if, it, if I did have a, a bigger tank where the depth was bigger, then I would probably use this as an extension. Uh, not only that, it has the measurements. I know you may not be able to see it clear, but it has the measurements in mLs, equivalent to uh, CMs. Uh, so like, let's say if you're feeding a controlled amount of liquid to the uh, reef and it's so, so many mLs uh, once or twice or three times a week or daily then here are the measurements uh, so that's uh, one of the um, pluses that this system has right now I'm not using it I was using it until about two weeks ago but I find it a little uncomfortable because uh, when I put the liquid food in here and when I go inside it will start to bleed it, you know, start to disperse it and, you know, it gets all over the place. So I stopped using it uh, for the last, I'd say, two weeks. But let me tell you, it does its job. It's a very, very good item to have. The one that I'm using is this one. This really does the uh, work for this small tank due to the fact that I really don't have to go in that much. And it also has uh, measurements here where you can measure the amount of, of uh, liquid food that you need to put in and then you just go in and target feed your corals as you go along. When do I feed my corals? Well, I'm feeding them at night. Uh, the mass spec Razor Nano that I have, I have it programmed where it starts at 8.30 and uh, it ends at 9 o'clock. So like let's say about 10 or 10.30 is when I go ahead and I feed the corals where the uh, feelers the uh, filaments of them are extended because in uh, like let's say in their natural habitat uh, that's when the plankton at night uh, goes into different areas of the ocean and that's when they feed so that's when I go ahead and, and feed them all less 10 30 or 11 at night what do I what do I feed them well once a week I feed them by uh, uh, bright well I, I feed them the microvore this is a liquid of food, it's a full spectrum food. Uh, by that meaning that it will target all types of uh, animals here. You can go like from swan teas, um, LPS, SPS corals, filter feeders, like feather dusters, etc, etc. So this uh, liquid, I use it, uh, you, you have to shake it first. I keep it on the refrigerator uh, so it will uh, store longer. Uh, I feed it once a week only on Fridays and then sometimes like a treat once in a while I'll uh, feed the corals and the fish the mice shrimp being this a small tank what I do is, is I just get a quarter of, uh, of a cube and I dissolve it on RODI water then I just pour them in and then when it comes to the fish uh, this is what I feed them I feed them the new era uh, food the uh, the small pellet, uh, pellets, I'm sorry, uh, this food is phenomenal. Uh, uh, matter of fact, these uh, fish, they actually feed from my hand. I have been trained where they, they actually eat from my hand. And this, I feed them Monday, Wednesdays, and Friday. And that's basically what I wanted to touch bases with you guys today. Uh, what do I feed? What accessories do I use to feed them? And when and how do I feed them? Again, like I always say, I do want to thank you for all of you to uh, taking the moment to view uh, this video and to check out my channel. And if you like this video, just hit the like button. And or, if not, then go ahead and subscribe to Eddie's Reef Aquarium. And I want to thank you very much and you have a wonderful day. Thank you.